Of the more than 4,000 vaccines administered, 1,215 have been given to frontline GHA staff, 28 to GHA patients, 437 to staff at elderly residential services, 152 patients at ERS, 17 patients at Ocean Views, and 2,339 have been given to those over 70. Many are playing a role in getting the jab to these initial priority groups as quickly as possible. Part of the effort includes doctors on standby to answer any questions or concerns from patients being booked in for their vaccine. Mainly the advice is uh, that it's very, very, very safe. Um, we've given, they were given almost a million worldwide with virtually no problems at all. Um, we've given almost uh, 2,000, I think, here, getting on that way. Here, we've had absolutely no problems at all with it. And the uh, people mainly concerned that if they're ill, they shouldn't have the vaccine. And it's the opposite. The iller you are, the more important it is to have the vaccine. So people over 70 years of age particularly, the, the mortality rate is one in ten or, or more. And it's very, very dangerous. There's a huge amount of it around. It's massively contagious. And it's just convincing people that there's nothing to fear. Have the vaccine. It'll protect you. And what do those receiving the jab have to say about the process? It's been perfect. I went in and they had asked some questions. They took my temperature. And uh, I just sat there after I had my vaccine for 15 minutes. They asked me if I was feeling okay, and then they asked me whether I would come to have a, an interview on television. So here I am, everything very well organised. I'm very grateful to all of them. I'm very impressed with the efficiency of this place. On arrival, hand sanitised, a new mask, despite me coming with a new mask myself. I was taken over to the check-in desk, checked in, given the paperwork. I sat down, within a minute I was called forward. I was shown where to sit, I was jabbed, I was taken to a recovery room in case I had any after effects and at all stages everyone was very smiley and very helpful. It is incredibly slick. On a more personal level, how, how do you feel having had the vaccine today after what's been quite a difficult 10 months? I'm keen to have had it. Um, there was never any doubt that I would want it and I hope everyone else feels the same. With restrictions extended and cases are still high, it's difficult to see the light at the end of the tunnel. But the work being done here is providing reassurance and hope for many of those most vulnerable to the virus.